Hey guys, this is Crystal. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing some crafts that is inspired by Coachella and uh, Stagecoach and the music festivals that are going on. Just pulled up to Michael's and I'm ready to shop. Hmm, those are really pretty. Should I do another black one or should I do this opalescent one? Hmm. Oh my gosh, should I get it? It's three dollars and then I can make it cute. Oh, I think I need it. This spoke to me and I uh, had to get it. So now we are doing a little mini backpack. So for the fanny pack, I got it for free at a little event and I already had this nice stretch lace, ordered way too much on Amazon, a choker that broke. This was only a dollar downtown. So I'm just gonna be using jewels off of it, little clasps and little circle connectors to hook up my backpack. Backpack, I'm gonna be pimping it out with all the jewelry stuff was 55% off. I am going to paint these zippers because they're silver and that won't match my stuff. And for the cover up of this branded fanny pack, I'm gonna be using some black acrylic leather paint. It doesn't matter that this isn't leather, it'll still stick. And then I'm gonna obviously cover it up with the lace so you won't ever see that I painted over it. Let's get started and let's start making some crafts. So I'm gonna start and grab some paint and start painting. Sorry, Angel City. Thanks for the fanny pack. We're gonna grab the lace. Let's Stuff it in and thread it through. Make sure you get the corner, allow for the bending. I'm getting to the end. I already had cut this to my size. I'm gonna cover the ugly hardware and tuck that in. And then I will glue that down also. Now I have that. And now I'm gonna take this and glue this on here. Okay, so I'm going inside where the corner is. I used five beads because I didn't have enough necklace to go around, so now I'm gonna finish it off with the little bead trim. I added a little diamond right there. And this is the back. So it looks like just a nice pretty lace belt. Whee! So happy. Okay, so these are on like fishing line. So I'm gonna have to, ow, I stabbed myself. So I'm gonna have to use my needle and thread and thread them and then attach them. To measure it so it's even, and if you can see each little stitch, I count all the little stitches and do the same thing on this side. So we won't have to mark up our pretty white bag. Okay, so now I have it all attached. Pretty pretty. I'm going to take a washcloth and stuff it in the pocket. 
so we have a nice fluffy pocket to work with so this won't move around. Okay, I have my E6000 and I'm just gonna start gluing underneath. Once again, I attached it in the corner from the inside, and now I'm going to put my glue all along this seam. And then I will put one more stitch down here to hold it secure. I'm throwing a stitch in just to keep it secure. put enough beads to line the side. And now I'm going to make a stitch into this corner. Doing a stitch in the middle to hold that down. Okay, so I'm gonna tape off the zipper so I don't get any paint on my bag. And now I'm going to paint with the nail polish. I'm gonna take the needle and thread and put it in the middle. And then string your beads. gonna take one of my little rings I had from the broken necklace. I'm gonna take my little tassel and attach it on. Bend it closed. mini backpack fits my mini chihuahua. Well, I don't think you'll fit also. <laughs> you want to come in the backpack? You like the backpack? Did I do a good job? I think she likes it. <coughs> yeah, okay. Are you jealous? <coughs> you want to be in the backpack? <coughs> okay, fine. Okay, fine. So when I'm at bottle service, I will be stuffing my tips in here. That's the real reason I uh, made this fanny pack because I needed somewhere to put my tips and not stuffing them in my bootleg or my bra. So now I have a cute little holder for all my money. Hopefully this will be full. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and apparently I've been told you have to turn on the little bell to get notifications when I post new videos and tons more videos are coming. So. Stay tuned for those, and if you have any questions or comments, please let me know in the comment section below. Thank you guys so much for all the amazing comments on my past videos and all the love and support. I love hearing from you guys. It's amazing, and thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys are warming my heart. Until next time, bye.